I love it. So I'm back at home real quick. So I just want to share with you guys my school haul. I guess I can call this a school haul, I guess you guys. So let's get started. So the UWL and college student or whatever, majoring in healthcare administration, and um, hopefully I will be complete by 2017, God's willing. If not, that's cool. But um, for English comp, I had to pick up this textbook. This one's called Writing Today. Um, oh, this is a UWF custom edition. Oh, I not that I hate these books, you guys, but what these books are, like when a school custom makes their own books, they take stuff from out of a certain another text and then they just only pull off what the teacher's gonna be mainly um, teaching. And then this can be a hit or miss with trying to sell back to the school. And I just realized that now. But they just printed this in 2014, so it's still gonna be good for another school year. So yeah, but this one's called Writing Today. So this one's gonna be pretty neat. And then um, for English literature, these were, I only had to pick up reading materials. So um, the first one is One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest. And I pretty much believe everybody has um, um, seen this book before or might have already read it. Me, I didn't have to read it in high school. We read um, To Kill a Mockingbird and um, Les Miserables. Mis Les Misery Miserable, how y'all pronounce it? Y'all know what I'm talking about, the Les Miserable book, or <laughs> whatever, and some other kind of textbooks too. Oh, their eyes are watching God and all that other kind of stuff. And then this one's called um, The Passion by Jeanette Winters Winterson. I never heard of this book, never seen this author before, so this is a new one. And then the other one is The Bluest Eye, and it's a novel by Tori Toni Morrison. Um, winner of a Nobel Peace Prize. So I think that's pretty cool. Oh, it's a black author. Oh, I'm sorry, y'all, but I get excited when I see African Americans uh, writing books. So I'm probably gonna start writing. I'm probably gonna start reading this one this week. So I'm excited about that. So, um, along with some other stuff, I picked up this very, 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 very pretty planner for um, the 2015-2016 year, and it's by Lily Pulitzer, and look at this, you guys, like, it is so pretty, like, with the flowers on it, I was instantly drawn to it, like, and it has flowers all on the back, and then on the inside, you have stickers, you have, like, a little folder, and, um, it's so pretty. Oh, this is for this one's Resort 365. Lily's Resort, all the above except we never leave the sunny state of mind. A lifestyle built in Palm Beach and perfect for any suitcase. Bright, inviting, happy. That's Resort 365. Guys, I can't wait to use this. And it comes with these pretty stickers. Pretty stickers. And then this is the front. Welcome to Palm Beach. And then this has all this stuff on here. It looks like a map. It is a map. It's a map of Palm Beach, you guys. Like, this is so cool. This is, like, very, 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 like, cute. Looks like. It has the calendars on the inside. And then it has the months at the beginning. You have a months tab. You have a dates to celebrate, travel, address, and notes. And then you have the separate tabs here. Um, for August, September, October, November, and December. So that's what this looks like. And I got this, you guys, because I'm pretty much busy all the time. And with me having to do with this anxiety thing and stuff like that, I can't just keep keeping stuff in my mind, like, as a mental note. So I used to keep a planner all the time, especially for school, because... Um, my schedule was like so erratic like it's just so sporadic it was just everywhere and it used to be I would get up go to the gym class work and then sometimes I'll have like class in the afternoon or sometimes I was like partially online student partially nighttime student and then I was still working and so my schedule was just crazy so I used the planner like all the time when I was at Pensacola State but the last couple last year I have not used the planner and I need to get back into the swing of it and um, you can put your addresses in here and everything of that sort and then it starts with the month of August so this is what August looks like it says keep it current so that's for the month of August 
but each tab has a different saying and then it just has your main calendar at the beginning of each month for each tab and then behind them um, and then you have the count then after the actual calendar itself it has the individual days where you can write in notes for like everything that you might need to fill in to keep a note of and that's what i like about planners like i do not like planners where they don't have it where you can write actual notes in it because it's cool that you have the actual calendar but that's not going to help me i'm only going to be able to write in so much and i write big as it is so i mean it really wouldn't help me at all and then in the back they have all of 2016 in the back and it's just really really pretty you guys and i saw this and i was just like i really 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 have to have this i was like this is just screaming esther it's just like esther you need to get this you need this in your life and this planner was 28 dollars you guys so by the grace of god thank you almighty one that controls the financial aid okay <laughs> Because I would have not paid $28 for a plan, you guys. Like, the most I probably paid for a plan was probably like $10, $12 max, and that was at Target. So, yeah, you guys, I'm glad I picked this up. This is like so cute, and I'm going to definitely start using this as of today because it's now August. It's August the 3rd. I picked up two, I just picked up two spiral notebooks for both my classes because I like to have my homework separate. I don't like to share a notebook for more than one class, and it's hard to keep track of more than one class and only one binder and one spiral notebook and those were $2.99 and then I picked up um a, um a plate what the, baby, what you call these things I guess a license plate I guess I guess a license plate thing but um I didn't get one when I was at Pensacola State I need to get one for my friend in my car I said that I'm an alumni so I'm gonna get that one next like I'm using mine to that oh I'm a college student thing you know get this get that bring your car out with your school stuff you know your alma mater and I, it's just like you know I guess I don't know how to get to the swing of that because I've never been like an actual like college student and have experienced like the full being of like being a college student I don't know I hope you guys understand what I'm saying because when you're just going to a community college it's completely different it's just like yeah because I work so that's the only thing I regret though like with college like I wish I could have really been a full time like for real for real college student like not a full time college student and I'm going to class and then working and all that, all that kind of stuff. I wish I could have experienced being a college student, living in a dormitory, you know, being in a sorority, you know, and all that good stuff but you know with the punches of life y'all so i just wanted to share that with y'all what i picked up at the school today i mean it was pretty much cool babe went with me, went with me to the bookstore so i mean thank god and all this stuff was like 180 dollars because this that one book for my english comp class was 81 dollars and 50 cents and then the planner alone itself was 28 dollars and then everything else included so i mean you gotta do the math that's a lot and that's the cheapest that i have ever had to pay for a semester for textbooks even with just getting supplies too so i was just like that is bomb so thank you baby jesus thank you almighty financial aid person and yeah you guys i just want to share that with y'all so it's a part of the vlog